we couldn't get it all together. We were arguing with each other and saying, well, you know, I want your bunk. Well, I want your bunk, blah, blah, blah. I've never told anyone this, by the way. But um, our manager said, well, why don't we just draw cards? We said, sure. So we shuffled the cards, said highest card gets first choice of bunks. So, you know, I, I reach for a card and I, I pick two of hearts. Cliff reaches for a card, he gets ace of spades, you know. James gets a card, and Lars gets a card. So Cliff has first choice of bunks. So he says, I want your bunk, Kirk. I go, fine, fine, you know. So he gets my bunk. I, I end up with a bunk in the front of the bus, which was, like, not as good. And that night the accident happened, and uh, it was a horrible thing because, you know, Cliff was in my former bunk. What happened that night was that um, the driver supposedly hit a patch of ice and the bus skidded. It shattered the windows and Cliff got thrown out of the bus and the bus landed on top of him. And uh, when it actually happened, I got thrown out of my bunk and knocked unconscious for like three or four seconds. And when I got and when I came to, I heard everyone screaming, but I didn't hear Cliff. And I instantly knew something was wrong because I didn't hear him. And I got out of the top of, of the bus, because there's an emergency hatch at the top, very top of the bus. And I turned around, and there was Cliff. And I just said, oh, my God. And I walked away, and I just I was in, in absolute shock. And uh, I, I, I was delirious. I was in shock. I was hysterical. Everyone was screaming and crying it was it was too unreal to just deal with it was like you know this doctor came into the room that i was in the hospital and told me that a bass player had died and that was it was just too unreal mm -hmm.